Yo, what's up, YouTube? This is a video showing uh, updates of what I had going on. Um, remember I told y'all about that Sensor Leopard Hobby motor I had and that I had the little Mini 8 and I was going to give it the full Exotech conversion just like the Mini 8 Truggy over here. Um, wanted to show y'all what I got going on. Check it out. Mini 8, low C. Exotech carbon fiber conversion, um, aluminum suspension mounts. I'm gonna get the aluminum uh, carriers and hubs and all that all the way around as well as not as well as the CVDs. Haven't got them yet, but they're coming. But here it is: the Castle Micro Mamba X, right there. Put that focus in on you. Again, I'm shooting this with my webcam, so bear with me. But uh, remember I said it's the ability to run a censored motor. So here we got it. 4700KV, 380 size, lever hobby, brushless motor, censored. So it's nice. And yes, it does run very smooth. I'm going to get a running video up for y'all soon. Uh, got a clear J Concepts chassis protector. So, yep, got the chassis nice and protected, but it's still clear. So, you can see that nice carbon fiber under there. Thought that was a sweet touch. But, uh, yeah, I run this on 2S only, man. Uh, 3S is insane. This motor is a four-pole motor uh sensor and dude it's got a lot of power i mean i can basically i can do standing back clips i mean this thing just pops willies and flies in the air just off 2s man and honestly i wouldn't even try to drive this on 3s it you wouldn't it's uncontrollable but yeah i got the uh, high-tech servo um or model uh I can't see it right now, but that's the 5250 or something like that. Well, the, the same high tech that everybody uses is the Metal Gear one. Um, but this is the Metal Gear digital one, though. Uh, so it's a little more than the other one. I forget the model number, forgive me. Uh, but all you low C mini fans, y'all know the server I'm talking about. Um, the high tech one. But anyway, back to the Truggy. Um, just run running video for you too. Uh, still got a little bit of work to do, man. I'm lazy. I didn't uh, solder all my connectors, so I just stuck it in and run it like that just to test it out. But yeah, I'm gonna get those soldered on and um, get this running video up for y'all. This here is basically a 4S setup. Um, by the way, I run this on 3S, and I'm geared high. Uh, I'm geared at 1856. So and the only thing that gets hot is the ESC, which I'm going to upgrade to a Mamba Max Pro. Um, I said in the beginning I was going to put in a Mamba Max Pro because I kind of knew I was going to need one. But I had this laying around, threw it in just to see how it would work. Um, and off 3S, the only reason I'm getting any speed is because I'm geared so high. Uh, if I was geared normally, uh, I would be so slow because this is a 2250 kV motor. So basically, it's 4S capable. This ESC is the only thing that gets hot. I can run this thing on 3S, run it hard, and the motor doesn't even get warm. Battery doesn't get hot. The only thing hot is the servo. So, and like I said, the only reason I'm getting any speed is because of my gearing. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, upgrade to the Mamba Max Pro, drop in the 4S, see how that runs, and which I know is going to be perfect. I have a ton of power, um, all carbon fibered out, so nice and stiff, rigid chassis set up, you know, so once I get the CVDs in here, I should be able to handle it pretty well. Uh, back to the Mini 8, you know, everything, carbon fiber shock towers, all Exotech. Um, I do have the Losi brand um, steering rack, though, carbon fiber, and, oh, RPM A-arms all around and man that's it next up random videos coming up later YouTube